There's more to leading a fulfilling life than only doing well in school. We need to have goals that we want to achieve outside of school too. Maybe you want to make some new friends this year. Maybe you want to learn how to do a new trick on your bike. Maybe your goal is to relax and reconnect with nature to relieve some anxiety. Think about what is important to you in your life outside of school that you want to achieve. Now write an actionable goal that will help you get there. There's not a pre-made sample list of goals for this. This is things that you want that are very personal to you. My goal is to make sure I take a, at least one walk a day to help me de-stress and relax after school. So I'm going to write that here under my life goal. Setting goals is important, but if we don't make these goals a part of our everyday life, we're not going to accomplish them. Um, now that you've written a goal for math, for reading, a school performance goal, and a life goal, your next challenge is to find ways to incorporate these goals every day or as many times as it's applicable. For example, Every time I'm reading, I need to make sure I'm slowing down to pay attention to the elements of plot. Um, when I'm struggling in school, I need to make sure I'm communicating to the teacher. Maybe I'm asking questions. Maybe I'm going to morning lunch recess um, homework center or I'm using my power half hour passes to help me with that. Uh, my life goal is something that I set to do every day, so I need to think about that every day. Um, it's okay to not meet your goals every day, um, but we're striving towards growing as a person and pushing ourselves to get to the next level. Because remember, as we learned in that first video, our brain is a muscle, and we can continue to work that muscle and improve our skills in any area. Hopefully you found this activity helpful. We'll be revisiting... Um, these sheets in winter and in spring and periodically to check in with our goals.